You fishermen? Oh, yeah, that's right. You did oh, do yeah. that. Um, it's been a really long time. I been like to fish, but Tanner never goes with me anywhere. So do I you can. have a fishing pole? You don't go no. anywhere. Mm. You're telling well, me. How the well, fuck yeah, are you going to go fishing if you don't have a fishing pole? Well, because I can, well, I can fish. Yeah, I can fish. But I'm, wait, I can do it alone. The question. You want to fish with me? We'll fish. Do you have a fishing pole? Not here, no. Then how are you going to fish? Yeah. Well, I just, no one ever, I, he, he never says you want to go fishing, so I was like, I'm not going Why by would myself. you ask someone that doesn't have a fishing pole if they want to go fishing? <laughs> oh, my God, dude. I, this is not a game of 20 questions. Dude, that's like asking happened. a three-year-old if you want to go <laughs> driving. <laughs> like, no, because he's so fucking ridiculous. three. Right. <laughs> this is just this is what happens, right? I'm going to get a fishing pole. What happens? Uh-huh. I'm going to get a fishing pole, bring it home. I said, Tanner, you want to go fishing? He'll be yeah, like, no. But you don't have your fishing pole. But Tanner doesn't no. have a fishing pole either. So, so why, you get would a fishing you pole? why would Tanner fish if Let he doesn't have a fishing pole? This is theoretical. If I get a fish, if I get a fishing pole, if I get two, bring them here. He still wouldn't go. That's you don't ask a priest if you want to do meth. Like you have to have, a, I have to ask, he, a, ask a meth addict if he has meth. Oh God, dude. You don't ask him don't a am, priest. This is stupid, dude. Well, anyways, it's what were we gonna question. say? So, are you a fisherman? Yeah, I, I was in Colorado. Yes. <laughs> you do a lot of fishing. What kind yeah. of what type of fishing you do? Well, I remember you were talking about this earlier. I'd like to do fly fishing, but I never did that because no one ever wanted to go with me. So and I didn't want to drown and collapse and fall in the river. So I didn't do that. <laughs> so. I've always just regular, just, you know, the old regular, you yeah. know, side of a lake. So, mm-hmm. Mel, did you go lake. fly fishing? Um, just I've, always, I've always been doing regular fishing. Right. So, nice. yeah, it was, like, the most annoying thing with my dad and whatnot because he would right. be the – he was the only fisher guy in my family. Okay. So, it was, like, if I didn't go fishing with my dad, it would just be by myself. I see. And so, um, we always did regular fishing, and he was a numbers guy. He was, like, so long as we're catching a shit ton of shit, She's that's good. Shit, baby. Yep. That's fucking good fishing. No matter what it Tiny is. Tiny little fish, big old fish. Yep. Yeah. Fucking so long as like least amount of effort. So he was like all types of the like right. re- put it out with some weights, have some power bait float to the top from the bottom, fucking let it sit, hold it, have some rock set up so it holds it and you just sit back and wait. Okay. Kind of guy. Right. I always wanted to like challenge it a little bit more. Like I wanted to do the rooster tails, drag it in. Like entice a fish and catch it. Right. Go to the, do river fishing, and he was like, "No, nah. that's how you spend four and a half hours throwing line and not catching shit." Right. And I was like, "All right, fine, Dad, you're driving, so I might as well just." <laughs> that's true. Yeah. Fuck it like I'll he was yes. like, like and like it's a huge argument. So I want to know what you guys think if you're an adult fisherman. Like he would always like track the Colorado fishing game oh, okay. website, oh, yep. and yeah. they would post when they would stock lakes with Ooh, trout and well, stuff. Yeah. Right. You gotta. I guess know that, right? Yeah, so, like, well, I mean, some fishermen are totally against that because if they're, it's like, oh, it's a stock lake, it's like, well, duh, you're going to fucking catch a fish, dumbass, I and see. this and that. Okay. So he would always fucking, like, that lake just got stocked. We got to go fish there. Right. And this cool, and that. That's fun. I mean, yeah, so it makes it really easy to catch fish, and that's entertaining, but there's, like, almost no challenge in it. Right, but so you're a numbers guy, so fuck it. Yeah, so. Yeah. I always wanted to get in fly fishing. Right. I wanted to get into river fishing. I want to get into that, but he wasn't really into it. What were, kind of fishing were you guys doing? They so I so I would fish in the Grand Mesa. Tanner's never been there, right? Yeah, I've been there. Never fishing though. There we go. So <laughs> he, <laughs> he goes there. We go. <laughs> so um, no, sorry. I I went there. I would go fishing by myself because Tanner would never go. So I went in. You, you know the natural. <laughs> Remember that time I wanted you to go to kayak. House and I, didn't I wanted fuck. you to go kayaking with me. What did you say? I'm fucking. <laughs> I said, I'm just letting it out right now. I said, Tanner, you want to go kayaking? And he said, for f- that's fucking dumb, dude. And I was like, kayaking's lit. I was like, you know what? I'll just go fuck off. And then so I just didn't go by myself. That would have been weird. Like, hey. No, well, you were drunk, though. I didn't remember that. Well, <laughs> that makes way more <laughs> sense. You're like, this is stupid. And I was like, all right. So Why the fuck would I want to go when I'm drunk? <laughs> you were always drunk, so you just never wanted to go fuck, in college. Yeah. <laughs> so it was a no, it's okay. Yeah. So, uh, I would just I would go to Grand Mesa, the Grand Mesa. There's a bunch of lakes up there. Mm-hmm. They have natural lakes. They're not stocked, and the trout is like pink when you cut it open. And everything, mm-hmm. and I would go to there was this lake called Water Dog Lake, and you had to walk like a mile or something, a little bit, mm-hmm. not not too far, just a little bit in the woods. And then every year it was like a different. Different amount of water, I guess, based on how much snow they got. Mm-hmm. So, but it was completely natural. And it was really cool. So nice. Yeah, that was so a great story. I'm I'm fucking ripped yeah, this out. is why this guy never went anywhere with me because this is, <laughs> yeah. you know what? So are you like? So you like had your fishing spots? Like you didn't care yeah. about if it was stocked or if it wasn't stocked? Like 
those were your spots, and that's just where you went. I you were that type of guy. Yeah, and I preferred. I like. I guess I don't know for whatever reason. I just preferred yeah nonstop because I did. I wanted to know what was naturally in the league yeah. because then mm-hmm. you don't know what you're gonna catch. Yeah. Versus knowing what you're gonna catch. Fishing was actually so, kind of a huge yeah. part of why I wanted to move to Idaho. Yeah, I've heard they got good fishing. Yes, right? they've really got good. great fishing. Really good. And so we should try to fly fish there. Yeah. Fun. So, um, yeah. Continue on. So, like, did you go this week? No, but okay. I bought some stuff. I'll talk uh, about. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So, yeah, but like Idaho, I really wanted to because in Colorado there was one lake that I actually did like. It did get stocked, but I loved it. It was just like kind of like a key place in my brain and memory group, and whatnot. Because you did have to. It was Pine Lake. Okay. Yep. That one was just, like, barely into the mountains. Pretty great. I loved that one. Pine Lake was so much fun. One time, my dad and I caught 23 fish in one day. Yeah. My whole family was there, and they were pissed as fuck. My sister was, like, tiny as fuck. Uh, She had this, like, national park, like, this pink cowboy cowgirl hat from a national park thing from a trip. And, like, she had it on, and we first started catching fish, and we're like, you're not taking that off. Can't stop it. (laughs) And this and that. My brother and my mom and eventually my sister were all sitting in this pavilion just like sitting there with a cooler and like Walmart fucking cold cut sandwiches and shit that we bought for lunch. And my dad and I would not leave the dock. We were like, the fishing's too good. It's too good. We're at 26 or something. No, we had caught 23. So we were like, we're at 15 fish. We can't stop. We can't just stop. That's sick. It was hilarious. Um, But yeah, I wanted to move to Idaho because like river fishing, huge. Lake fishing, pretty big too, but more river fishing, uh, like Snake River, Boise River, and all this and that. Mostly fly fishing, though. And then also, like, one of the cool things when I was watching Meteor, I found out like this. It was like there's a lottery or raffle thing for the fish in the fuck, for rainbow trout in oh, the rivers. Okay, yeah. Do you know about that I one? I think I've heard about it, yeah. Yeah, yeah. so, like, they found, so, like, they kind of did a vote with the, Idaho people, and they were like, would you prefer just more fish in general? And so, like, it could be non-natural fish. Like, rainbow trout is not a natural species to the Boise and Snake River and stuff like that. Right. Or do you want more natural species present Mm. than unnatural species? And Idaho was like, we would like more natural than unnatural. So they were like, fuck, now we need to get rid of all these rainbow trout and shit that (laughs) we stock the rivers with. Yeah. Yeah. So they figured out... Instead of the fishing game, just going in, shocking them, and taking out all the rainbow trouts and then tossing back, like, the brown trouts and the cutthroats and all that, yep. they were like, it will be more efficient if we shock them, put microchips in the rainbow trouts' heads, what? and then tell the f- that count for a dollar value, and then tell the whole entire state, you can turn in a rainbow trout fish head to fishing game, mm-hmm. and if it has one of those microchips... It could be worth from five dollars to a thousand dollars. No way. Yeah, so you could get a thousand dollars by turning in a rainbow I trout fish heard, yeah, head. I've heard this. Yeah. That is. I what? talked to everybody. They're like, I've only gotten one micro trip fish, but still, it's like they figured out and they did the math. They were like, if we have all the fishermen catching and killing the rainbow trout More instead fish. of us just trying to catch all of them, right. it'll work out way faster. So yep. they're doing that. That makes sense. That is very smart. And it's I heard fun. that, and I was like, I could go fishing and get paid a thousand dollars, possibly. Oh, yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Sign me up, bro. I'll Super fucking do that. Super fun, too. Yeah. yeah. But, like, yeah, obviously, like, kind of fly fishing's kink here. Yeah. Like, fly fishing's the thing. Regular fishing is fucking lit, and a lot of people do it, but it fly fishing's the king. That would be pretty fun. Right. And I tried to get in fly fishing in Colorado before I went into the Marines. Right. And then when I went to the Marines and my mom moved... The movers stole my fly fishing rod. No. <laughs> and so no. didn't have a fly fishing rod <laughs> anymore. That sucks. So didn't get to learn. And then uh, Lady's dad is really big into fishing. No kidding. And he's into fly fishing way more than just regular. Right. So I was like, fuck, I got to impress the fucking lady's dad. Right. I got to get into fucking fly fishing. And I talked to all my buddy, <laughs> yeah. my guys at work. A couple of guys are really big into fly fishing. So they're like, yeah, I'll show you. I'll fucking teach you. I'll teach you the ropes and that shit. And this and that. I was like, right. Yeah. fuck yeah. Yeah. And this and that and blah, blah, blah. Got a $100 fucking gift card to Cabela's for yeah. Christmas. So use that and then fucking bought a starter kit. I mean, a lot of fucking fly fishermen on YouTube, if they ever see this, they're so. going to be like, you're a pitch. Yeah. <laughs> if we're getting a fucking starter set, you need a fucking $200 reel and a fucking $150 rod. Yeah. Out. Get. 
you can't do starter sets. Until you get one of them, uh, you know. Uh, I get the kids one at Walmart. The yeah. kids ship the <laughs> fishing pole. <laughs> yeah, see, that's what. <laughs> what are those good get for? Get the princess belt, John. That's funny. <laughs> yeah. yeah, get a fucking frozen or a yeah. fucking yeah. 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 stitch yeah. fucking pole. You got like ten foot line. That's it. So you you stupid kid can go. Ugh, and yeah. then it's just like, dude. Sometimes <laughs> those things catch, catch. I, I had a Scooby Doo pole, and that thing caught. I had a not to make fun. Pull, but yeah, yeah you know. basic one, right? Yeah, so like I, I can work. Fucking catfish, no shit. Damn, big one, big jump. Well, it, I say it's that big, but that's how big it was when I was a kid. So. Oh yeah, sure, it could have been different. Yeah, so, so it's like still. almost as tall as me though. Yeah, so yeah, you need to buy a fishing pole, and you need to buy a fishing pole. You can be regular because yeah, I'm like fucking set pole. on regular, and I love regular fishing right. and lake fishing and shit like that. Yeah, I'll get a regular one. But I did buy a fucking starter kit. Okay. And talking to my buddies, and that's dude, what you did this week. Yeah, dude, I need okay. to fucking learn. I never realized how much it fucking. I don't know if I know a fuck ton, so I about regular fishing, Probably and not. so that's why <laughs> I don't think there's much to right. it, or there if I'm is. just super uneducated about it. But I, I'm just like, I guarantee it's complicated. Like yeah, because like regular fishing, it's like, depth. oh, I'm trying to go for this fish, so I'm going to use this hook, this bait, do this, and right. it's fucking easy days. I don't even have to fucking think yeah. about it. Like if I'm going for pike, I'm going for, I'm going to do this. If I'm going for trout, I'm going to do this. If I'm going for bass, I'm going to do this, and blah blah blah. And I never stress. Right. But with fly yeah. fishing, they're like, oh, you got to do nifs, or you got to do fucking flyer yeah. fi- high fit, and like drop you flies, and you like got to do this and that. Like yeah. there's like all these things, and I'm like, what the fuck. Like, yeah. I got to think about all this before I even truck and cast a line? No shit, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? That's true. That does make sense. Well, yeah. obviously it'd be more mm-hmm. maybe intricate, but. Yeah, so it's like, I feel like there's so much more to learn, but like, I need to learn, learn. Like, I need to, like, yeah. I'm in that situation where it's like, fuck, I got to impress the lady's dad, because, I mean, you got always got to be a bigger man than the lady's dad. <laughs> like, you got to fucking show dominance over the <laughs> dad. <laughs> at uh, least try to, right? So. At least try to. Like it's yeah. all, it, dude. That Dilly, you don't know, but yeah. Uh, well, hopefully, <laughs> I fucking find you know. Tanner, one day you know, it's like do. you. It is low key a competition between you that's and like, the lady's dad. That's how you become tight with the dad, though. I mean, right? That's it's maybe cool. not necessarily tight with the dad, but enough respect from the dad to be like, yeah. Yeah, if it is a serious thing. relationship, and you're like, maybe one day we might get married, you have to do it because, yeah. like, oh the yeah, dad's sure. not going to be like, yeah, I'm going to let my daughter marry a pussy. Right. Like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> true. So yeah. Oh, Tanner's yeah. giving up on the headphones. Uh, fuck, dude. <laughs> I need a fucking break, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what a fucking bitch. <laughs> oh, Sounded God. like Dilly. Uh, um, usually. Yeah, but it's like, it's like usually I mean, like, I'm sure Tanner can attest to that. He was just I like, yeah I've, yeah, I've had to do some shit where it's like, probably not in my comfort zone. Didn't really want to do it, but kind of have to do some shit just to fucking show off that I'm fucking <laughs> the man. <laughs> <laughs> look at this guy. Look at the look at the Shit, camera. Bro. Are you getting Shit. drunk over there, Tanner? Shit, bro. I don't know about that, but I'm feeling good. <laughs> Tanner's fucking feeling it. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Well, fucking had fucking two of them. Ridiculous. No. So I'm on my sixth I, shot, essentially. So uh, it's scrumptious. It's I good stuff. Yeah. So yeah, we need to get in fly fish. But did you know anything about fly fishing at all? Ever? Jesus all I Christ, know is you're you just drunk. All I know is you just take the little stick and you go, sup, 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 and then they fucking yeah, go. dude. This Saturday I was walking. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fucking. That's a clip. That's Jesus a Christ! That's a clip. Everybody's gotta watch on YouTube for it. Yeah. <laughs> so like, I, I was fucking like, I was talking to one of my coworkers in the break room on Saturday right before I was gonna leave. Both of us got sent home early, and he's one of the big fly fish guys. Oh right. Okay. And this and that, and I was like, so well, like, what do you do? Like, right. it, like you and I was like. I'm like, I'm stupid. So, like, basically, you're trying to mimic a fly, like, tap in the water, right? Like, it's yeah. not just, like, sitting there. And he's like, well, unless you're doing nip fishing. And I was like, what the fuck is that? Yeah, and he's I like, know. I didn't. So, now yeah. I'm learning fucking biology. Like, That's I cool. Jesus. learning more than I did in zoology class <laughs> with fucking right. in high school right. with that stupid teacher that fucking thought I was a jackass. <laughs> um, one that started. The one that played with Mercury. I don't know. Oh, yes. Yeah. I know who that is. Yes. Yep. Interesting um, person. Yeah, the one that played with Mercury and sipped lean. Sipped lean by accident. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She, did. she was like, oh, God, I have this whole coffin fit. I'm so sick. I need to drink all this cough syrup, but I can't drink that much cough syrup. So I mixed it with Sprite and I just feel weird. This is and this and that. Oh, <laughs> Some kid was Jonah. like, yeah, Jonah was like, uh, uh, that's lean. That's called <laughs> lean. That's <laughs> yeah, so that's awesome. Lean. But like, anyway, yeah, she's a lunatic. But I didn't even yeah. learn this. Like, 
Those right. fucking flies and bugs that like tap the water of those rivers and shit, right. they lay eggs into the water and the egg hangs out for like three years underwater and Jesus. then hatches. What? The it, up to three years and then hatch up and then go up and then they're the f- bugs that are tapping the water again. No way. I always <laughs> wondered that. I was like, where the fuck does the bug go in the winter? It freezes, and then yeah, yeah, and then like talking right. to this guy, he's like, yeah, so like nymph fishing's big in the Boise River, so like you got to do that. And I was like, what's that? And I was like, well, you put a bobber on, and you put the nymph fly, and you have that sit underneath. And I was like, oh, so just like regular fishing, but with a fly rod. And he was like, and he just stared at me like I just spat in his grandma's face, and he was like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically like that. <laughs> and I was like. I no disrespect, but like literally, you're like put a bobber on, put it in, let it soak right. in the river, and let the fucking. I can do that with any rod. I don't need a fly rod to do right. that. Um, That's true. Like I was just like, so you're not doing any of this, and he's like, well, you do that to get it out there, and then you let it sit, and then you pull it back, and you do it again until it, when it floats downstream. And I was like, yeah, so regular fucking fishing. I right. could, I yeah. didn't yeah. ever need to buy a fly rod to do that. That's true. interesting. That's cool. <laughs> um. But yeah, I bought a fly rod, so hopefully I'm learning a lot about that. So you need to be fly- buying a regular rod or a fly rod, either yeah. or. We could learn together, or we could just do regular fishing together. I'd and you need to buy a rod too. True. Well, last funny enough, last year I talked to Tanner about it once. You probably don't even remember because I I was so quick. I was just like, man, I think that we should go fishing. It would be pretty cool. And then I just never really, mm-hmm. never, because it's a little farther. It's out of the city, of course, but. I mean, I mean, I see guys. I mean, it's fly fishing. Yeah. But I mean, right. so if you can fly fish, you can catch trout in the Boise River in downtown. Oh yeah. Well, almost downtown. Oh yeah, true. But that'd be pretty fun. Yeah. yeah. So I'll get I'll, I'll get a regular fishing pole. I've never had like a real like a n- nice fishing pole. Somewhat uh-huh. nice. I've always Only had that. Had your princess one. I've had the. Eh, no, shut up. I've had the <laughs> shitty ones that like the like, ones that you bought. It's like the mm-hmm. Reese. It's like all in ones. Like forty five dollars yeah. from Walmart ones. Yes. Yeah, I mean, th- see, that's also the fucking thing. Like, I was talking to all these guys, and they again looked like looked at me like I spat in their grandma's face. But yeah, like, you probably preached about the fucking cheap bitches. Well, I was just like, "What's wrong with the starter kit?" And they're like, "This, this, and this, and this." And I was like, "Yeah, but does it do the job?" And they're like, "Yeah, but not that good." And I was like, "Still gets the job done." Still yeah, and done. I was like, "I can always change out the rod." Right, and they're like, "Well, yeah," and I was like, "And I can always change out the reel, yeah," and I can always change out the line, yeah. yeah. So it's like, why don't I just get a starter kit and change <laughs> out what I want to change out over time? And they're like, "Well, but th- that's not the best." And I was like, "I don't know what the best is. I'm starting at square one, bitch." Like, <laughs> right? Literally, I'm a fucking baby that don't know how to walk. What, sure. what the fuck? I don't know. Why are you t- making a baby compare Reebok, Nike, and Adidas mm-hmm. at fucking eight months old? Right. That bitch ain't doing shit with nothing right now. So That's like, true. what the fuck? Like, right. let the bitch just get some baby shoes, and then he'll decide what the fuck shoes he wants. Fuck, that's the best analogy I think I ever heard in my life. Billy didn't hear it. No, <laughs> I heard it. <laughs> what did you say? I don't know. I zoned out. <laughs> <laughs> How did I know? I definitely did. Yeah, I'm back though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you better be. Yeah, fuck but just learning so much. Drink I'm fucking. I'm tired. So yeah, drink more. <laughs> You no, got it. You got so, water. to our water. new 29 fucking subscribers and any viewers of this Sheesh. episode, Sheesh. shout out. I love you guys. Yep. If you know a fly fisherman, or you are a fly yep. fisherman, or you know any fly fishing YouTube channels, fly away over please here. Please send them my way because yep. I need all the help I fucking can get. I'll try to make a, like a regular YouTube video about fishing. Yeah. Just yep. cut this. Into like a yeah. its own video. Yeah, what kind of fishing did you do? T- Dilly just talked about la- like lake fishing. Oh, you did whatever. I know his sister fishes plenty. I know she posts oh, fishing yeah. way more than Dilly does. Way more of a she man. Pond fish fishing a thing. Oh yeah, pond fishing. Yeah. Way more of a man. Way more of a man. Um, well, that's messed up. Who me? No, Dilly's sister. Oh. <laughs> well, no, I'm not getting into. She's it. a good mm-hmm. woman. She's a good person. Um, but more of a man. All right, get over it. What were you gonna say? <laughs> so. <laughs> No, my um, when I was growing up, he doesn't anymore. But my grandpa owned, I don't know, it was like four hundred acres in Montana, something like that. Oh wow, oh, yeah, yeah, but where you caught grasshoppers and fried them up. Exactly, oh, told gosh, that story yeah. before. If we put a little cheese sauce on them, you know, oh, scrumptious yeah. little chips. <laughs> oh you <know>? my god, <laughs> 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 so great! <laughs> I love how you guys totally thought I was kidding. <laughs> yeah, we so looked that ass too. Oh my god. <laughs> Sweet that was one of the chips. best moments we've had. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look, pop it. <laughs> chips, you pulled. I got to fucking oh, we we gotta find w- that. watch that video again. Yeah. That was so good. Um, so, yeah, he had, uh, he had like a pond, lake, 
almost it was fucking huge. But uh-huh. we had fish in that, essentially. Nice. It, but fucking four hundred acres, so yeah, we would just drive over to it. Um that's where I caught the cat catfish. So you nice. probably had it till I was like fourteen, probably. Yep. And that's the last time I fished. So Oh, okay. Did so you ever do the time. pinery fishing? I f- I did. Go with I didn't do it, but I went with somebody that did. I would always go there by myself <laughs> or I would obviously well, don't don't what are you gonna say? Am I going to say yes? Am I going to lie? He goes. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just take your homework and copy it. <laughs> Let me just change it up a little bit. Let's just, Dude, I don't want to copy this. Thing. I don't know what I'm saying. but you I know, don't know what you're saying either. It cracked me up. He goes, didn't do it, but I went with someone that did. <laughs> That's exactly <laughs> what I mean. Jeez, dude. Good job. What, what a, no, this just cracks me up. No, it's just funny. Yeah, it sounds like plain English to me. No, it just it's like that's like saying I didn't. <laughs> I don't know what an I don't analogy. give a fuck. It's like I had a fucking partner for my presentation. I just stood there. Yeah. Okay. All right. Continue. All right. It's just yeah. Funny to, you. to help you with. I that mean, now. yeah. I would go fishing there with my dad, and I would go like because I was a mute. <laughs> I <laughs> I was a mute. God, weren't you ever? Yeah, Jesus I would just Christ. go fishing by myself also and yeah. whatnot. And that was hilarious because, like, Peaceful multiple up. people would go fish. Like, plenty of kids would go fishing there, and they would see me fishing. How funny is that? The and they would literally. boy being a mute as young as fuck now he's fucking on the podcast. Yeah, it's fucking hilarious. It's so great. God. It's like AJ Hawk. Um, <laughs> <laughs> True. Yeah, people yeah but, like, literally people. people would see me there. Yeah. Or they would m- sometimes see me there with my dad fishing and all, all that. But they would see me fishing there. They would literally come up to me in class. Right. And they would be like, hey, I saw you go fishing there. You want to go fishing sometime? And I'd be like, meh. <laughs> <laughs> no, nope, I meh. never go. I don't know. You saw somebody else. <laughs> yeah. I was just, meh. And they were like, so, no? And I was like, yeah, I just kind of do it myself. And they were like, oh, what, what the fuck is this weirdo on? 